Okay, four. Scarecrow, Toy Man, and Tut. Why do I talk about this? It's because those styles are very important, I think, in popping. Okay, um, there are two reasons for this. The first reason is because um, it's better to know how to do these styles. Not only know, but actually use these in your freestyle. A lot of poppers know about the scarecrow, toy man. Tut. But they never use them in, in their freestyle. I don't think that's uh, knowing it properly. If you know this, if you know these properly, you should use these in your freestyle. Uh, only teaching people what these styles are and never using it in your freestyle means you don't know uh, you don't know how to do them do you understand? because you can only do them when you teach and not you are not able to do them in your freestyle you are not able to use them um, if you have these styles right um, in dance, feeling change is very important. If your feeling doesn't change, um, your dance uh, gets boring very shortly. Okay? So, um, when you're dancing, right, you suddenly become a scarecrow. This is a law of impact. Do you understand? And when you're dancing, you suddenly become a toy man. It's just the law of impact too. And like you're well, dancing and then suddenly you poo 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 poo. poo. Suddenly you become um touching style, that's a law of impact too. So Knowing how to do these styles is very important for feeling change. You can transform into a different dance while you're doing your freestyle. So that's the first reason why these styles are important. And um, when you're doing these styles, right? scarecrow for two seconds and then do something else, no one would know that you did it and it has not much impact and then it won't uh, be looked at as feeling change because you, you stopped in a, such a short time, okay? Suddenly you become a toy man but then you change again, then um, it's, it's not very good because it doesn't show, you, show the people clearly that you have changed the style or changed the feeling of your dance. Do you understand? So what I suggest is if you become a scarecrow, you do it for a certain amount of time. Okay. Before <coughs> doing other styles. Same as for Tatum. If you started it, don't stop, stop. Don't stop. <coughs> Very short, you just do it for some while so that people know you have become 
touching style. Can you understand? So, <coughs> um, these styles are very important for feeling change. Okay? Style changes are feeling changes, so that's why they are important. <coughs> and the second reason is, there's a reason why I mention only these three styles. Um, Scarecrow, Toy Man, and um, Tut. That's because you lift your arms. Okay? It's very important that you lift your arms in dance or popping. It's because when you pop, right, it's much easier with your arms down. Okay, if you dance like this, it's much easier to pop. You understand? Popping is easy when you have your arms down. But it, it's like if you want to pop in this position, it's very hard. Okay? So if you lift your arms and popping, it becomes a great impact because not many people do that and when a lot of poppers dance they usually have their arms down so when you lift it up it becomes a great impact do you understand? so the reason I mentioned these three styles is because it's hard to pop with your arms up, right? Same with Toy Man, it's hard to pop in this position, okay? And especially this position is very hard, okay? So it's important that you practice. Um, one of the end, one of the purpose of dance, what I think is, um, is to free your body. That, which means, freeing your body means you can move anywhere, okay? You can move any part of your body in any way. That's what I think freeing your body means, right? If you can't lift your arms properly, that means you're not free in your dance. Okay? So, um, and with the popping, right, especially with the uh, leg pop, I explained why doing in this way is important. It's because you can do it in any position. Um, likewise, it's very important that you can lift your arm anywhere and you're still able to pop. It's very important, okay? Or else your dance will always look like this. Whatever you do, your arms will be always down. And that's, uh, that's not good. Um, and I will tell you for some tips for these styles. Um, Scarecrow would be straightening your arms, but um, bending your wrists. This is Scarecrow, okay? Um, but Toy Man straightens the uh, wrists and bends the elbow. That's Toy Man, okay? So that's the difference. And for Tut, you bend the wrist and the elbow. That's, that's tight. Do you see why I um, talk about these three styles in particular? Okay. <coughs>